Okay, today we're going to talk about a four-way valve, reversing valve. See how you got the slider inside? Okay, now we'll talk about the heating cycle of the reverse valve. I want you to look at this little slider. Plunge, slider, whatever you want to call it. Got the reversing valve on the heating cycle, so it's going to shift. Most of your companies, and we'll talk about this later, the reverse valve energizes on cool and de-energizes on heat. We'll talk about that later. So, all right, so anyway, on the heating cycle, you're coming out from the high pressure side of the compressor. It's going to go through here. It's going to go through this line right here, up here. This line here comes out. It goes through the indoor coil. Goes to the indoor coil, goes to the TXVs, the bi-flow, everything. It comes around, it comes in through the reverse valve, it goes through the outdoor coil, out of the outdoor coil into the reverse valve again. It goes through here, it goes through the little cup, comes out and goes to the suction side of the compressor. That's just a simple take on the reversing valve. I'm going to actually take the valve and I'm going to slide it all the way to the left hand side. The left hand side is the cooling cycle, okay? The high pressure gas is going to come through the bottom here. It's going to come out this pipe. It's going to go through this line. From here it's going to go into the outdoor coil. It's going to condense into a high pressure liquid. It's going to go out. It's going to go all the way through the air handler. It's going to go through the indoor coil. When it comes out of the indoor coil, it's going to come in through this one right here. Indoor coil. Go down. It's going to go through this hole right here. Then it's going to go right here. It's a cup. If you look in here real quick, it's like a cup. It's going to go out right here, and it's going to go out back to the compressor. So to sum this up, High pressure discharge from the compressor it goes from here to the outdoor coil. It goes through the outdoor coil all the way into the house. It comes back in through the indoor coil. It goes through the little cup back to the suction side of the compressor. That's just a simple way to talk about a reversing valve. And if you like this, please share, please subscribe. Please comment. Thank you.